Welcome back to Medical Student Life in Japan. We will have a brand new podcast today and quite an exciting one. As we mentioned a couple of weeks ago in a previous podcast, it's the start of the new school year in Japan. And that means we now have several new members to our podcast team, which is quite exciting. There are some students from first and second year, and both medical and nursing. So we will have lots of new voices and new ideas to make this podcast even better. Uh, up until now, we've had listeners from 32 different countries around the world. So we're quite excited about that. There's nothing more motivating for students than to know when they're speaking in English that there's an audience out there listening to them. So they're quite excited to know that we have all of these listeners. So thank you for listening and uh, creating some new motivation for these young medical and nursing students. Today, I will interview two of those new students and Yudiko, our regular uh, member, will interview two other students. It uh, should be quite fun, so we hope you enjoy it. Thanks again for listening, and let's get started. Here we go. Okay, now I'm going to interview uh, the next student, and this is uh, Yuka. Hi, Yuka. Hello. Hello, Yuka. And Yuka, you are a second year nursing student, is that correct? Yes. Okay, can you tell me, um, maybe the first question I'd like to ask is, why did you choose uh, this university, Nara Medical University? I have two reasons. Okay. First, uh, I'm interested in the human and their feelings. I see. Then I, I thought that um, when I know about nursing, I can know both of them. I see. Oh, that's really interesting. Yeah. Second, I live in Nara. <laughs> okay. And um, around this university, mm. We have a lot of old, old buildings. For, for example, Kasuga Shrine. Uh, yes, love, yes. Yeah, I love ancient buildings. So I enjoyed my um, going to university, looking about the um, scene. I so understand. I choose, hmm. Yeah, so I choose this university. I see. Yeah, Nara is very interesting. It's you know, one yeah. of the, it has a very uh, ancient culture in Japan, and it it was the capital of Japan many, many years ago, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Maybe more, more than a thousand years ago? Sorry, I'm bad at history. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no, 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 don't worry. <laughs> um, I didn't mean to put you on the spot, but yeah, it was the capital, and um, you mentioned, uh, sorry, did you say Kasuga? Kasuga Shrine. Kasuga Shrine in Nara City, right? Yeah. Yeah, really old temple. And there's also uh, here near the university, we have uh, Kashihara Jingu. Yeah. Which is also a really uh, famous um, shrine, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, I agree. It's really uh, quite beautiful around here in Nara, um, even I though it so feels too. a little bit uh, like countryside. Mm. Yeah. Okay, that's great. So, um, now you're a second year nursing student. How is uh, your study going? Are you enjoying nursing college? Is, uh, maybe you can tell me what you're enjoying, what's fun, or what uh, maybe some things that are difficult as well. Mm. I love face-to-face -face class. So mm. now um, I don't enjoy my college oh. so much. Mm. But, you, mean, you mean because of the pandemic situation? Yeah. Mm. But uh, in online too, for example, this, this Zoom, mm. I can talk about um, one subject 
and um, exp explain myself. So I enjoyed online class. Thank you for that, Yuka. I appreciate that. In fact, Yuka, you're also in one of my other uh, classes as well. Um, so that's great. And um, yeah, it's difficult because of the pandemic. So we have many online classes, mm. but um, at least we can still meet and do some study together. And as you said, we can have some conversation, which is really nice. Yeah. Uh, Yuka, can you tell me, do you have any hobbies or interests outside of study? Mm, my hobby is calligraphy. Oh, cool. Yeah. How long I, have you been doing that? About 10 years. 10 years, wow. You must yeah. be really good. Yeah. And <laughs> I went to Kasuga Shrine okay. at the first of the year. Ah, on yes. January 1st, and I, do, I did kakizome. Oh, cool. What is, can yeah. you explain what is kakizome uh, for our mm. audience um, who's maybe not familiar with Japanese? Mm. Kakizome means, mm, ah. kakizome is the event mm. that people write the goal of the year. I see, I see. So but like like a new year's Shrine, resolution. Yeah, so for example, I want to get up early mm -hmm. and <laughs> go, um, go to the um, space. Yes, ah, I see, I yeah. see, okay. But in Kasuka Shrine, mm. we have uh, the staff gave us the same. That, so I we can't decide what we write. Interesting. Okay, so they give you a theme and you have to write something connected to that theme. Yeah. Oh, okay, interesting. Cool. Well, thanks a lot, Yuka. Um, it's great to have you in the podcast with us. And I look forward to all of your great uh, contributions to the, the podcast. So I'm going to finish our uh, interview here. It's great to meet you. And for our audience, you'll, you'll get to hear Yuka's voice again, I'm sure, soon. Thanks, Yuka. Thank you. Okay, now I'm going to introduce another student. And this is Sugaru. Hello, Sugaru. Hello, my name is Suguru Imanishi. Hi, Suguru. Um, can you tell us about yourself? Uh, for mm. example, uh, what year are you? What year student are you at Nara Medical? Uh, I'm the first year student of medical. Okay, medical okay. Student. First year student in medical college. Okay, great. So you've now been in medical college for about one month yeah <laughs> how is it so far uh it takes two hours from my house to the school <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> so i was so tired mm. these past few days i understand <laughs> <laughs> but today you're on zoom so yeah. Uh, maybe online class has some advantage for you. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I see. And um, that's great. Yeah, I know it's it's a long commute for many students. Uh, maybe, maybe in your second year or third year, you might move close to the university. Uh, yeah. yeah I, I think that's pretty common. Yeah, it's a good mm -hmm. idea. Um, why did you choose medical college? Uh, medical college. Uh, my... Grandfather and mother die because of mistakes. Oh. And uh, some of my friends in high school wants to, uh, who wants to commit the suicide, mm. comes to me for advice. Wow. Yeah. 
I see. And so on. <laughs> wow. Okay. So very, yeah. I mean, those are very important reasons. So um, uh, when you said your grandparents died from mistakes, do you mean some kind of medical mistake or? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I uh, see. Medical mistake. I understand. Okay. Well, I'm very sorry to hear that. Yeah. Um, but I can understand that maybe uh, you want to be a doctor so you could hopefully uh, avoid those type of mistakes for future patients. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I see. That's a great, great reason to become a doctor. Mm -hmm. And yeah, um, you, you mentioned another very personal issue. And in Japan, um, mm -hmm. it's, it's one of the topics that comes up in our uh, English courses. Uh, the suicide rate is quite high in Japan. Mm. and um yeah that's a very difficult issue and um uh maybe maybe related to psychiatry or psychology maybe mm -hmm. i see okay well that's really interesting yeah. um thanks for sharing um and uh have you thought about what kind of a doctor you want to be any specific uh field uh -huh. of medicine or you're still not sure yet? Uh, yeah, I I can't decide yet. You can, okay, well, you're, you still have <laughs> a few years, so don't worry about it. Mm -hmm. um, do you have any hobbies or interests outside of study? Uh, I like sports. Oh, cool. And cooking or drawing. Cooking. Oh, I also like cooking. Uh, what kind of dishes do you like to make? <laughs> what kind? Uh, mm, mm, I I make mm, every kind of mm, every kind of food. Wow! And mm, look up how to make how to make the dish. Are Are you watching some maybe recipes or some YouTube? Uh, cooking show yeah. or yes yeah yeah, mm. yeah i do that sometimes too i also like cooking and so um these days mm. there's so many resources on the internet ah yes to, mm. to help yeah great um that's cool do you make japanese food or do you make more other food like italian food or chinese food or oh uh, i often make chinese food chinese food like uh gyoza Ah, oh, no, I haven't made, no. made it. Okay, how about uh, uh, ramen? Oh, ramen. Ramen is easy to make. Ramen is easy, <laughs> yeah, it's easy. Uh, chahan. Chahan, okay. Fried rice. Ah, oh, fried rice, thank you. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Mm. I really like that one. <laughs> that's great. Well, Suguru, thank you for uh, sharing your information and... Um, we're going to finish up here, but thank you for your introduction. And I look forward to uh, having you join our podcast uh, class. Yeah. And hopefully we can um, make a lot of great podcasts and share uh, information about medical college in Japan with uh, people mm. around the world. Mm. Okay. Thanks a lot, Suguru. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Saki, why did you choose a medical school? Um, when I was in high school, I had a chance to go to hospitals and see how doctors work. And th there I learned that uh, doctors uh, not only treat patients, but also uh, they hear about uh, the patient's concerns in their daily lives. And since then, and I wanted to be a doctor who can not only treat patients, but also can uh, help and take part in uh, the patient's uh, lifestyle, lifetime. So um, that's another one reason I wanted to join uh, the medical school. And another reason is that uh, since I was in junior high school, uh, I was uh, interested in medicine. And also I liked uh, learning biology, especially, especially the uh, function of a human body. So mm -hmm. that's another reason why I joined a medical school. Uh, okay. Um, do you, uh, are you interested in any specific 
uh, field of doctors? Uh, no, um, I haven't decided yet. So, and I heard that uh, we can look around many fields uh, in the future. So I wanted to choose uh, which field I want to uh, learn in the future. Okay, thanks. And how about you, uh, Koshiro? Um, my mother is a doctor. So I vaguely decided to be a doctor. But um, when I was a second grade of high school, my grandfather was taken to ambulance and I was next to him and see ear doctor helping him. So I felt like they are very cool and I decided to be an ear doctor. Okay, I see you are very interested in ER doctor. Yeah. Can you explain what it is like? Um, they help people who are almost dying. And so they don't do all surgery but like they just do some, um, they like cure some injury that connect to death. Okay, I see, thank you. And Misaki, what made you join this class? Uh, the teacher uh, in this class, Michael, uh, <laughs> told uh, uh, about this class for me. Uh, last year and I was interested in talking with other students in English uh, outside the class so I decided to join this podcast class. Okay thanks and can I ask you uh, what you want to do in this class or in making this podcast? Yeah um, I want to uh, introduce Japan in many interesting ways uh yeah so uh for example last year i heard that you drank many kinds of juice and yes. tried the taste so uh, like that i want to do some inter interesting things yeah thank you okay how about you um Koshiro? um i joined this class because i heard this class uh we have to take this class to join research clubship um so it may be impossible to join research clerkship, but um, I don't want to lose chance, so I decided to join this class. Okay, uh, I'm sorry about uh, you're not uh, you cannot join the research clerkship for uh, in other countries like Canada, but uh, I want you to enjoy this class, uh, making many podcasts. Yeah, yeah. and. Uh, what is your hobby, Misaki? Um, I like listening to music, uh, especially J-pop, uh, Japanese pop music. And also, uh, when I was in junior high school, in high school, I belonged to the brass band club. So I also like listening to brass band music. And another hobby of me is that, uh, so these days we have to stay home. So uh, I often bake cookies or cakes with my mother. So that's another hobby for me. I mean, yeah. Okay, and what is your favorite singer or song? Um, yeah, um, these days I like listening uh, to Dai Hirai's song. Mm -hmm. mm, yeah. <laughs> okay, and how about you, Koshiro? Um, I like playing table tennis and doing some exercise. And I also like playing games and reading comic books and listening to music. Okay, um, what type of music do you like, especially? Um, I like listening to old foreign music. Okay, and um, what songs do you like the best? Um, I like Queen songs the best. I see. Mm. Okay, and what types of exercise do you like to do um, in daily life? I have sandbag in my home, so mm -hmm. I usually punch them Punch it or kick it. Okay, you're very strong. <laughs> Thanks.